hello and welcome to BNM learning in this video we are going to show you how to send an email notification using Oracle integration cloud what we are going to do is we are going to modify this schedule integration which we have built in our previous video I have provided the link for this video in the card section kindly check out the video first of all I will deactivate this once deactivated click on this edit button after calling our uh, rest learning integration we are going to send an email notification this bell icon we have to go for this actions and select under generous this bell icon that is notification drag and drop it in the swim lane give some meaningful name and click on the create button here we have to fill in the details like from address to address subject and the body what we are going to do is in the from we are going to go no reply email address or the email address uh, which you want to show in the from section in under 2 we are going to give as binum labs at the rate dot com which is our email id click on validate close under subjects concatenate environment Click service instance name basically this will extract the service instance name like your development instance production test instance uat concatenate this comma and the what you can do is you can add the instance id when we send the mail also we can do some meaningful message Once done, click on validate and close. In body, we can type hi binum followed by message. This is this is a test mail followed by signature. What I'm going to do is we are going to create a variable over here for signature and I'm going to pass this signature in parameters copy this we have to give any variables within this body within flower racket this it over here parameters assign it to some value if you want to assign it any variable then we can select it over here as we don't have any variables what we can do is we can hard code the value like bm OIT YouTube click on validate close validate if you have any attachments we can click click on this plus button and pass the reference file reference okay as we don't have I will delete this click on close click on save click on close activate this integration enable tracing once the integration has been activated, I'll run the integration. As you can see it over here, as you can see it over here, we have received mail from our Oracle Cloud integration instance. If we go to Oracle documentation on notification, it has specified that it supports up to 2 MB uh, of data which could be sent uh, using a, a email notification in Gen 2 and in Gen 1 it was 1 MB and uh, Oracle has uh, given uh, documentation in brief how to uh, use this notification or the bell icon how to send the uh, HTML uh, in the body I will give the link in the description kindly check out this link in order to show you how we can send this HTML HTML kind of uh, uh, message body let me go over to our integration deactivate this integration click on the edit symbol modify our notification I have already created an HTML sample email 
uh, which consists of uh, CSS styling. Okay, okay, style for uh, this header and our body contains one small message like integration test mail where where we are sending the integration name and the ID. Let me copy this. Go to this instance. Control Hall paste. Let me pull this integration name from our metadata variable. Click on validate, close, validate, close. Activate and run the integration. As you can see it over here, I have received email notification from our Oracle integration cloud. The message body having styling in CSS okay like we know YouTube customization uh, with the name has been passed by our metadata thank you for watching this video please do like comment and subscribe the channel